Hey guys, still there. Welcome back for episode 37. We're going to start this episode off with a new captain. Captain Malika Lazy Turtle Jawahir. She now knows the Jammer ability, and this puts her right on the rank of captain, so that the next ranks are going to be a lot more interesting, but she needs a bit more field experience in order to get promoted again. So, time to see if we can put her on a mission, and not just her. I would like to try out the new spark that I got on the last one. Now there are some missions coming up, but this one's expiring in 14 hours, so no thanks. We have one in 3 days and 14 hours, and another one in 15 days and 2 hours. So none of these are very good, except for this one, and I'm already sending a team there. Now what I can do, in the meanwhile, is make contact with New Australia. Commander, we've utilized all of our available yes, Shen, I know that. We can't establish Make any contact here. Until we'll give we me the continent bonus for Australia, which is spare parts, and that is going to reduce proving ground costs by 33%, which is a really nice investment. That is um, getting the beacon up here, which I already have. You can see the transmitter tower icon over there. And then making contact here will allow me to get that upgrade or that to boost. Local regional con I do not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Now we have some upgrades, <coughs> and um, some of these are very, very nice. The Vibro Blade. This is um, a defensive weapon, and I believe that this is the weapon that gets handed to the gunners. So the guys who cannot really get that big gun to swing around onto a new target quickly, they're going to have to rely on this thing. We also get the Tactical Vest, and we get the Plasma Grenades. The problem here is that I cannot quite get these. I need the Proving Grounds. Um, I can go for, let's say, psionics next. I would love to get this thing, advanced magnetic weaponry, but I need alloys. Now the question is, what do I have a lot of that I don't actively use? And I think the that we have a more bunch of corpses lying around. Imagined based on the rumors, but it still sounds like they'll be relying heavily on us to handle both strategic. We have a load of trooper corpses we can render. Hopefully get some alloys from that. Oh, hang on. New orders, Commander. We're not going to switch to the globe just yet. I need to get that research done. So, we're going to go for Render Trooper Corpse, which is going to take me one day and only get me two alloys. So I need to do that a few times, or a few days in a row. And I don't really know how to describe the render process, but I think that they're taking his armor apart or something. New mission, 7 days and 7 hours, very light enemy activity, we can find a VIP there, we can find a lead. It's another engineer that we're getting, always a welcome one, and um, this is something I haven't really dug into yet. Finding a lead can be the first process or the first step towards liberating an entire region, which I believe means that Advent will not have any further operations in that area. So let's get on this mission, for and if possible, I'm going to send the Spark. The Spark is uh, pretty hefty on infiltration times, there is that. Here you are, Spark number one. We're going to dress this Spark up a bit. I usually prefer these things in all black, because I think that that at least does them a bit of justice. Yes, yes. I'm going to give him the Schwarzenegger, let's say the Schwarzenegger radio effect voice. I have my orders. This is war. I think that that would be <laughs> moderately appropriate. Um, for faces, we're going to go something along the lines of Terminator. And we're going to make this guy as dark as possible. Main armor color. Uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Now that's starting to look at least a little bit interesting. As for props, you don't have that many options. That is, until you unlock new stuff. I think this one looks a bit better with the cushions there on his shoulders. Not that he's likely to need them, but you never know. Now for the torso, we're gonna equip him with all sorts of pouches, which are purely decorative, including the padding there on his back, because you cannot actually attach anything to these. Still, the spark is gonna go on the mission, and especially if these things level up, they get some pretty interesting abilities. They can be used as modern or mechanized armor. Um, they already come with one point of armor. What they also have is their hacking ability. So 
If push comes to shove, you can use them as hackers at range, but mostly for just securing objectives. I wouldn't hack a Comstar with them. And what they can also do quite well is just absorb damage, because they come with five ceramic armor. Now as for loadout, I have absolutely no options, as I have not unlocked any sort of upgrade here. Unfortunately, I cannot upgrade his weapon. There is a mod that allows you to do that, but I'm not sure if that works with Long War 2. And if it doesn't, then I might mess up the save game, so I'd rather not risk that. Now let's send in our new captain, Malika. It's a very light activity mission, which means that I can send in quite a few guys without having to worry too much. Um, it's also a rescue VIP, so I do have 14 turns. Extract timer, 14. Um, I would like to train up this sergeant here, bastard, but he is set up as a full sniper, and that makes him a bit more difficult to use on a mission like this. Who else do we have? VK, back from the hospital. I hope that I won't be the one putting him back in anytime soon. Let's go for a diverse squad. Uh, Wilson, I could use you. Five days and ten hours is what we're currently at. Let's see, one of these guys is built as a mobility sniper. I think it's Lulu. Yep, snapshot. Look at that. 18 mobility. That is very, very impressive. And I'm going to give you the scope to minimize that impact of the snapshots. As for the rest, let's make all of those AP rounds available that we took on the previous missions. Especially the ones that we sent to get uh, the spark. As for weapons... You have the Elite Suppressor, which is something that I'm going to give to Wilson to make sure that he can possibly kill from stealth. Let's see, what are your abilities exactly? Um, you don't have that last tier yet. The one at this tier. But that's okay. Next, <coughs> we have uh, the Grenadier. Who's for a Grenadier? Remarkably mobile at 16, and that includes with a very, very heavy loadout. Give me the weapons. Mag rifle, elite scope. That puts him at an aim of 85. That's really good. Probably a bit too much, in the sense that he doesn't need that much. Now, he was using a stutter mag, so now he's going to have a maneuverability or a mobility of 13, which is still good enough, I'd say. I don't believe I can actually build plasma grenades. Um, not really. Nope, nothing there. Unfortunately. I would love to use a couple of those. The other guy here, the specialist, has an aim of 70. I'm going to give him very high aim. Oops. Great. Now I get to do it all over again. So, it was the Spark, it was uh, the Gunner, VK, we had Deadpool on there, Sergeant Wilson, we had Sergeant Mester, and I think that that was as far as I got. Let's go for Chatterjee, 6 days, 13 hours, we can probably get one more in here, maybe a technical, eh, 21, 21 hours, that's... That's a bit much. Maybe if I go with an SMG, I can push it down 20. <laughs> yeah. No. Um, I already have a Grenadier for explosive damage, so that should be enough. As for Chatterjee, she has the trench gun, she has killer instinct and extra conditioning. So what I need to maximize on her is the critical damage chance. And I have shotguns which do exactly that with advanced laser sights. As for the rest, a smoke grenade, I'm not going to give you that one. You probably won't need it. And as for explosive grenades, not so much either. I just want you to be very, very quick on your feet. So we have the mag rifles, we have one cannon, which currently does not come with AP. Now it does. 
We have uh, the specialist. How are you set up? As a field medic. And you do come with a med kit. Okay, I think that should do it. Off you go. Let's go get our engineer. Sky Ranger deployed. Let's see if any other missions pop up. Oh, there you go. There's the first two alloys. Let's do that again. We only have two, so we're gonna have to do this a couple times. Next mission. Eight days, three hours. Ambush an enemy troop column. Reduce enemy strength. Expiration. Eight days, three hours. Setting course for sector five. These missions India. are usually fantastic to train up your snipers. Because they can just sit somewhere and ambush absolutely everybody. So this would be a good mission for Aslan to go on to. And Franku, you are also set up as a snapshot sniper. Do I have any others? Yes, we have Felix, of course. Felix is definitely going. And for Felix, since his aim is already very, very good, I'm going to give him the laser sight to improve his critical chances. Let's see if we still have a scope lying around. Unfortunately not. Um, I'd rather not send this guy in without a scope. I mean, it's possible, it's just not the preferred course of action here. Let's see, we're going to need a spotter, like Vanish. We're going to need some explosive damage slash flamethrowing. That's going to be provided by Ulf. We're going to need an officer. Reef. That's the second technical. We could use... Let's see, how many do I have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's two snipers. Um, I'm going to send one more on this mission. Boise. Now I'm going to slightly under... Or over-infiltrate the mission. Which will allow me some bonuses. Hopefully that's enough. Uh, Reef. We still have a stutter mag for you. Okay, you're gonna get the laser weapon. Vanish. Eh. It's not great. Unfortunately, I'm pretty much flat broke, so I don't really have enough... Oh, actually, I can build a mag rifle. Ah, that's gonna cost my mother two alloys. Um... Or a stutter mag... Let's get a stutter mag. With a stutter mag, he can at least zip around. Now let's strip weapons of upgrades that we're not actually using. Uh, at least laser sight. Do we have a silencer anywhere? We don't. That's unfortunate. Let's go for an advanced expanded mag. A scope, maybe. And... Fine, we'll give you an autoloader. The sniper now can pick up a scope from somewhere. Damn it, I put, just put the scope on the SMG. Pay attention. Surrender your scope. And instead, you're going to get a laser sight. Elite and all. So now we can upgrade this one. Scope. Elite expanded magazine. Stock. Felix, your rifle is very well set up. Yep, that'll work. Let's see, do I have enough med kits? One, two, three. That should do. Felix has a pistol. He's not very likely to use it. Not at the ranges that I'm intending to employ the guy. What he could use is a AP round get a bit more damage in. The same goes for Aslan. Five days, zero hours. I'm intentionally not sending in an eight-man squad, because now I still have six guys left for yet another mission. And I hope that by over-infiltrating the area, I can get this to light. Something like that. Let's go. Sky Ranger deployed. Another trooper corpse. Carry on. 
Supply raid. Okay. Um, that would be very valuable if I can get the alloys. Setting course for sector it's not going to be easy, though. Asia. I'm running low on forces. Heavy enemy resistance for five days and eight hours. The benefit that I have is that most of these are very experienced troops. It's going to be a very mobile strike team. But that's about it. Avenger what do we have on the black market? Course. Can we hire anyone? Because I do market still have a ton it. of those Illyrian cores lying around. Which they're still pretty hungry for. Damn it, there's no one there to hire. That's unfortunate. And they, yeah, they do have alloys. Okay, there. Now I can start to work on the research instead of having to render another corpse. But this mission? I could spend intel on it. Setting course for How West many people Asia. can I field? Six. Is it going to be good enough? Questionable. Very, very questionable. I got an assault. A gunner. A specialist. A shinobi for spotting. And two sharpshooters. I'm going to be over or under infiltrated here already. So if I get it down, I'm going to get it down to moderate. But I don't have any explosive specialists here. So as much as I would like to go on this mission, I don't think it is warranted. I don't think we can actually get away with it. And come back with everyone. Okay, let's get the advanced magnetic weaponry. 18 days. Bloody hell. Or combat armor. Combat armor. Too many of my people coming home in pieces or not home at all. I'm gonna stop that. Next mission. Five days, zero hours. Moderate heavy. Get another scientist. I don't think that we can get this done. Or well, it is from an advanced cell. But moderate heavy? No thanks. Let's see. Recruit Jonathan... Or CN Jonathan is available. Let's do that. Let's get Gene Allen and CN Jonathan. What are you guys good at? Nothing in particular, although you are a pretty good hacker. So Alan is going to be a specialist. And Jonathan... Let's see, what do we need? We've got three assaults, four grenadiers, four gunners, three rangers. I'm going to send Jonathan in as a ranger. So GTS... Alan... Specialist. Let's see how high we can buff that hacking stat of yours. And you're going to be a ranger. Good luck. As for new combat tactics, there's not that much that I can get that's really worth it. Carry on. Time to go on a mission. I've been talking for 20 minutes. Oh, great. More hit points. New mission. Four days, two hours. Ambush a troop column. Okay. Setting course for sector I'm going to have to send my last Indonesia. team in that mission. And then spend intel to get them in there as fast as possible. But if I can ambush another troop column, that's another load of corpses that I can either sell or render. So let's get that done. I don't really have any fantastic weaponry for them, unfortunately. Unless I whip out the wallet again. We have no magnetic weapons lying around. And they are going to be pretty important here. Uh, build. Mag rifle and a stutter mag. Mag rifle for you. Stutter mag for you. Now as for upgrades, I think we're running pretty low. Expanded magazine would be useful for you. Uh, this specialist... 
Sentinel, so I can buff his overwatch. That would help. And then for the snipers, I can get you a stock, but that's about it. And both of these snipers are set up as rapid responders. They are not very good at shooting at extreme ranges. Oh, let's give you hyperreactive pupils. The sharpshooter already has speed. Shinobi already has something. Officer already has something. Jump. Equipped. And you're already equipped as well. Uh, can we get one more load of AP rounds? Yeah, and that's it. I'm out of... What am I out of? Cash. Yeah, that'll do it. Medkits, one, two, three. That'll do. Let's go. Sky Ranger deployed. Apologize for the lack of action so far. We're setting up a load of missions here. Yeah, as much as I would like to go, I can't. New to Jesus, how many missions are there? Nope, I don't have the manpower. Well, I got two back from the hospital. That's a good thing. Okay. This is getting the engineer. I believe that this is the mission that has the spark on it. Yes. Correct. Very light. Let's go. Advent is holding a VIP of some importance to the resistance movement. And the spokesman has asked that we intercept the transport vehicle and rescue the target. We'll have to take out any hostile forces protecting the package to secure the area. Now, the interesting thing is going to be that he is going to be running into a spark. Spark could be a bit of a burden on the team because they are not that good initially. Their accuracy is lacking at 65. But they do have a decent amount of skills for at least soaking up the damage. And I can always repair him, same as I'm <laughs> mostly repairing my own troops. So we'll just have to see what this kind of mission is going to bring. The spark isn't even in the building, by the way. It's not missing, or it's missing in the animation. Menace 1 5, we have a confirmed location for the VIP. Move to rendezvous. Eliminate all hostile contacts. That's a four man squad right there. We're in concealment. It's not that far. I really dislike roads, generally, because Good. they give you so little in the sense of cover. Oh, four snakes. Whew. Okay. Oh, and there's more. There's a turret. Alright. Um, it would be nice if the spark could use this. Just wipe out all the snakes. That would be very much appreciated. The thing is, you can usually see a spark coming from a mile away. I have my orders. <laughs> it's so crazy to hear that voice. Alright. Do. Deadpool, you do have a, I have a decent accuracy. I'm not going to chance it. If we are going to start pushing, we're going to push right through that turret because I don't need anything shooting me in the back. Go, go! Spark on Overwatch. He's not very likely to hit anything. Being a spark, we'll but you know. Push comes to shove, we might as well have some shooter. Snakes are coming this way. That is good news. Now if you could all line up in a moderately tight fashion like that. Ooh, it's party time. Spark! Would you like to use that big gun of yours? And we can only get three. Do I need to back off more? 
I understand. How do they not hear that thing? Seriously. See, now we got them all. Uh, open fire. Boom. It's and that perfect. is how we deal with snakes nowadays. Come and get me. Now, this instantly got him three kills, besides the mission experience that he's going to be getting. And this allows him to really quickly level up. That's the plan. Okay. Uh, Deadpool, you need to be a bit careful. We have a ton of abilities on Joe here. Pitbull, this is yours. I'm going. Dead. And you dropped something there. Big deal. Turtle. I got something. Uh, I can get a bit closer for you, but not much. You do not have shredder, fortunately. I'm on it. So I don't have to hope for that. Do you have combat protocol? You don't. You do have rupture. Uh, this thing has a cooldown of how much? Four turns. This has a potential to instantly kill it. Let's see if we can do it. Go. Take him down. Holy shit! That was a good shot there, Mister. That's how we deal with turrets. If you don't like him, you just blow him to shreds with one rupture okay. shot. What the fuck are you doing? Ooh, there's more. Now, Wilson, first pick up the stuff that's right in front of you, alright? Advanced stock. My snipers will be happy. Good. Now, if we can avoid that group, then that would be nice, but I'm not sure if that's the safest way to do it. Because you never know when those guys pop in. If they decide to pop in at a time of their choosing, which happens to be order. a time that I'm not prepared for, then it's going to be a hell of a mess. And I don't like that. Already there. So let's prepare you with a grenadier attack. What? Oh, now we're going to be in trouble. That was my last move as well. So now these guys all get an action. Watch the sides. Oh, shit. I got my people out of cover. Like, a lot. That's going to be a stunner. Maybe the, me uh, the medic can get him back on his feet. Not sure if he has revival protocol yet. Here's the mech. Don't go with a grenadier attack. No! We talked about this. That didn't feel good. Looks like the armor took most of the damage. Okay, this is Ooh, this is going to shit fast. What's the snake gonna do? I think I'm oh Christ! She just killed Chatterjee. No! Bleeding out. Holy shit. Well, we got our work cut out for us right about now. Get the guys in cover and stabilize who we can. Move up. Revival protocol is going to fix you. Um, where's stabilize? Is that not something we can do from afar? Because that would make it a bit more complex. Like a lot. Arnie. I need you to do your damage against this thing. Ugh. Oh, what a son of a bitch. Yeah, you don't say. From one combat walker to the next, that was terrible. Okay, time to use revival protocol. Oh, this is stabilized. Uh, revival. I can get her back on her feet. So first we're gonna stabilize. Copy. Then we have Lazy Turtle. And we have Deadpool. I'm gonna have to use Deadpool as an active shooter because this is starting to go terribly, terribly sideways. 
turtle. You may need to suppress both of those if you have the range. Which you don't. That makes it more interesting. This is possibly a kill. This won't be a kill, but it'll neutralize some of his abilities. Let's see if we can get this little drone down. Okay, that saves me one target. Hostile terminated. I've located target assets. Deadpool, you cannot get up on the roof. You cannot get close enough unless I activate Shadow Walker. I'm gonna try and get a flank shot on that guy. You short a couple of mil, I go on the street for you. What options do you have? 64? I don't like a 64. At all. Um... I could flashbang these, but I would put him in a terrible, terrible spot. If I don't use him as a shooter, this mech might go on another grenade attack, if it isn't on cooldown, and go for these two. Even if I take an ambush shot at this guy. There's only a 22% critical bonus. So it's not very likely to kill him, unless I get a very high roll. Alright, stay safe, Wilson. Just spent a long vacation in sickbay and I don't intend to send you there again. Now please, fire at the spark. That is not the spark. Damn it! He's like, actually dead. He fired at the spark and missed? That's curious. All because I sent my grenadier too far forward. Don't do that. Indeed. That's all of his ceramic armor done. So. Fine. Chatterjee, back on your feet. Right about now. There we go. I'm going to heal you up. So we have full capacity oh, back yeah. in Chatterjee. I'm going to park you over here. That means you can still attack the mech, but you won't take fire from the other two. Because that thing does count as solid cover. I believe they cannot <laughs> see him like that. Uh, 74. Okay, do it. High roll, but the guy still has two hit points what left. What killed the dinosaurs? Guys, hey! Okay. I'm gonna see if I can get an Overwatch shot on one, if not both of those. Moving to position. So suppression fire. We've got admin here. Christ! Could yes. you add four more, please? Because the party wasn't interesting enough. Because now we are definitely being flanked. If not by that mech, then by the guys on the other side. Pitbull. I need you to... I don't know. Run up here? There? There. Set him up, knock him down. Indeed. Moving out. Be quick about it, because we are dying. Kill. Back down. Okay. Now I could flashbang these two, buy myself a turn. That could work. Because Turtle needs to find some way to get herself into cover. I'm not losing an officer. I refuse to do so. And I think that the only form of reasonable cover is inside this structure. On your order. Now, 
if I have him launch his flashbang, that's going to put him in a pretty exposed spot. So that's still not a very desirable outcome. They don't know where he is. They do know where Deadshot is. For now. You know what? Fuck it. We're going to overwatch him. Maybe it works. Maybe it doesn't. We'll see. Oh shit, a stunny. I can't focus. I think they got me. Come on. Grenadier. Oh, you just blew the whole building apart. Yeah, now she's dead. Because now the officer. Wow, you took a pretty terrible position there. Is the last guy gonna shoot? Oh, we still got these. Watch! Missed! Damn it. You fucking cockroach. I'm afraid that swearing Fuck isn't yes, really Lord, going to kill them. Alright, the spark's alright. You missed? That's fortunate. We still have one shooter on the right side. That guy. Uh oh. Ooh, 41. Take him down! Yeah, be quick about it. And they go on Overwatch, of course. I can give it a try. You cannot give it a try. You can get the hell out of there. I wonder, I wonder, will the trench What's gun have enough range? It does. Wipe him out. Or at least hurt him. What?! 200% chances and they miss? What the hell is this? <sighs> okay. So that's unfortunate. Five to seven. You do have Shadow Run, don't you? Yeah, Shadow Step, you don't trigger Overwatch. But is that enough? I can kill him. Immediately open myself up to an attack from the officer. God knows who else. The Naja might die, but it's a pretty long shot. I do have my spark standing around. I'm just not very convinced about his accuracy. I'm gonna push him there and then shoot from the side. Now, Overdrive is an ability that gives him three actions. Unfortunately, the game is not very good at showing you what kind of actions they are or how much room you have to maneuver. 76. Oh, you gotta be kidding. These are not bad chances. You son of a bitch. Correct. These are not bad chances to hit, but once again, not very well at all. Um. Now the issue here is that we have a sentry, or a guardian. What are your chances? <laughs> None. She needs to get out of here. Desperately. How about throwing a flashbang the other way? That might work. There. That'll neutralize the overwatch. Come on, Pelican. Right, so now you can get out of here. If I give you a revival protocol first.
now we are completely out of hit points. I could go for a gremlin heal. Give her a bit more mobility. And then... These two aren't that much of an issue, but this guy is. He is going to cause all sorts of problems. Um, if I shoot you... <laughs> Not really. <laughs> 42. No thanks. Maybe from over here. So we're going to have to send in the heal bot again. And I'm starting to pretty heavily run out of heals. She still has a med kit, but it's not ranged. Ugh, your mobility is terrible. If I use command, who can you see? You can see Deadpool. You can see Deadshot. What could Deadshot possibly do? Shoot? Maybe. This doesn't end your... It does end the turn. Where do we go from here? Or would you just fall back? And hope that that stun lancer doesn't have the mobility to come close. Or that these guys don't somehow attack me. I don't know. Roof? Terrible. Indoors? Here? Maybe? That could work, but that stun lancer's still gonna come for me. I'm going to head her over here and hunker down. Holding. Hopefully all of the defense is going to allow me not to get hit by the stun lancer. Because I'm very much expecting him to come at me again. Oh. No. Oh, Christ. You're going for Mester. Here's the grenadier. Or the engineer, technically. Flashbang. Trick shot there. What's going on? He's running off and reloading, that's one thing. You're making your way elsewhere and reloading as well. Okay, that's a bit of a breather. You're going to take a shot and miss. Then we have the other guy. Also misses and probably won't get his overwatch. Somebody should do something about this, this horse. Okay. Yeah, sure. This is a 55. I will happily take a 55% chance if I know I'm not going to get flanked next turn. This is better. That's one down. Plenty to go. Dead shot. I may have to heal you up. Uh, let's reload your gun. Pitbull. From over... From over here? Can you get a shot? I hope it's worth it. Her accuracy won't be incredibly good, but it might be enough. Just a grazing shot. Weak hit. Now I know that I've made some serious fuck ups in this mission, but <laughs> I'm missing very high value or may have high chance shots, so that's not helping either. No problem. Let's park him there as a bit of a doorstop. Can move you here. Is that a flank? Might be. Moving to position. It is. Okay, try it. Okay, that's another one down. Target eliminated. I need you to heal yourself up. Why do you only have one action? Are you disoriented or something? 
What's going on? Well, he has all sorts of problems, but... Um, I didn't use any of his actions that I know of. But I am concerned about him getting shot. Hunker down. Copy, I'm on it! Okay, so we got a snake, we got a guy over there. We have two guys over here. We're now back into active roles. You're gonna take a shot at the spark. If you're gonna do damage to anything, do damage to the spark. Because I can live with that. I don't want to risk losing another soldier. Oh no. I think it poisoned me. <laughs> Just what I needed. Fortunately, the spark isn't affected by that. He's marked. Let's see how accurate that sentry is able to shoot at me. Hopefully not too much. But it opened the door. Took a shot and missed. And he's on overwatch again. Okay, this is bad. Do you have a med kit of your own? Menace one five, be advised. Oh, Hostile God, interceptors are inbound on your current position. Firebrand has a limited you don't have a med kit either. Extraction. Wonderful. I'm of a mind to just run up to this snake and shoot him in the head. Just the, yeah, the spark can do that. If I'll it hits. Back. That's the big chance with this guy. There you go. Cocaine. Right. Who's next? Five to seven, that's not enough. Five to seven on the Guardian, that's not enough. This is decent cover, though. I could blow away his cover. Use demolition. Uh, first of all, I'm going to buy myself... I'm going to get Jammer. Oh, I need to... I only have one actual action per turn, because I want to avoid those reinforcements, and Jammer can do that. I can delay the arrival of those guys. That means I won't get to spend another action on anything else. These guys are closing in. Alright, let's first take a chance here. Hopefully wound him a bit. You have to be kidding me. That's another 74 that he missed. Worst of all, I need to get her back to someone who has a med kit. Or I could do a remote heal. If we are going to do that, then you first need to get out of that smoke. That poison cloud. I'm going. That's a terrible shot. Heal her up. I cannot have her be poisoned at the same time. Copy, I'm on it. Okay, that's better. Now I can use run and gun. Let's say run over there. Ah, oh, he's just around the corner there. Hunker down. Ah, uh, you are fresh out of medkits. still have eight turns left on this mission, but I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to be seeing reinforcements real soon. And, of course, suppression can only get one of them. Fine. Suppress. Come on, poke your head out. Deadshot. I need you to send an aid protocol to Deadpool, because I'm thinking that he might get attacked. Then you need to start moving towards the exfil because your mobility is now terrible. And if you don't start running, you might not even get there. What do we have? 
three, four guys. Heavily armed. Uh oh. How did you avoid that suppression fire? Jesus Christ, seriously? What use is suppression fire if it doesn't hit? Oh dear. Flank shot. I took you out the fucking hell! Deadpool's bleeding out. It's one of these missions. And this is light enemy activity. But basically the whole fucking team's gonna die. What do I have? I have Pitbull. I have my officer. Who might be able to get here. Pick him up. And then start running the fuck away from there. See if that works. On your order. You pick him up through a wall? Please? Yes. You're not gonna be shooting anyway, you're just gonna be running away. Not a problem. Yeah. You say that now, but we're not out of the woods yet. This guy is still posing as a pretty significant risk. I'm not sure how good his mobility is. This might be the Let best spot that I can find. Pitbull. We're gonna be making a run for it. Stick and move. And you're gonna run all the way over here. Got it, moving. Please kill him. Seriously. There. One down, thousands to go. Now, as much I'm as I hate it, I don't think I can pick up Mester. It is just not going to work. And he has rupture shot, so I spent let's say I think four plus eight plus two I spent twenty-four days in the Advanced Warfare Center, and I'm now going to lose that ability. And that really sucks. Where did it all go so horribly wrong? What happened in this mission? Surprised that she didn't get shot at. Not unhappy about it, just very surprised. He's gonna bleed out in two turns. I cannot get there and back. I don't have a med kit. Get as far away from this place as you can. I do want to see if there's any overwatches over there? here. Oh, hello. So no overwatches, but not safety either. Over there. Over here. Could get flanked anywhere. Except on the roof. Move, move, move! Spark. How far can you run? Come on! You. I would love to get the VIP out of there, but I would probably have to use the trench gun on the vehicle, and I don't know if I can get the engineer out that way either. So you're gonna have to I move here.
He's moving up fast. Got an officer on the roof ish. You can take shots at the mech. Spark. Spark's alright. We're getting rushed. Taking fire over here! 11% chance to hit her. Well, at this point, I'll believe anything. Yeah, I know. I know he's bleeding out. There's nothing I can do. I can get you out of here. That would be a first. How far can you run? Not quite to where I need you to go. The spark is not going to be able to get out of there either. Alright, your move, shot move, to escape move. is right now, so go. I'm gone. That's one operative out of the mission. Okay. <laughs> Where do we go? I think this might be the best option that I have. Unless I want to chance low cover. But I'd really rather not. And this. Maybe this is slightly better. Location confirmed. Not a lot, though. Because if that muton decides to pull out his grenades, then this just gets worse. Like, a lot. Overwatch. Shit. Oh, you're lucky that grazed you. Could have been a kill. We're not done yet. You're going to take a shot at the spark. And you're going to hit. Spark's going to be out of action for a week or two. The one I'm really worried about is the stun lancer. I believe there is one. That was close. Ugh, two overwatches. Deadpool is dead. And so is Mester. Fantastic. Okay, that means that considering you're the most healthy of the bunch, I need you to absorb the overwatches. Okay. I said... Absorb the overwatches. One and the other one. Come on, fire at the mech. That's one. And the other one just refuses to do it. Fine. Malika. Okay. Well, she's now carrying a corpse home, but at least she's out of here. Let's go. Now the spark's gonna go down. Watch this. So that's. Four out of my six guys killed off, and the mission's a fucking failure. He's flanking. And so far as that matters, suppression fire. Well, according to your own game mechanics, suppression doesn't do anywhere, anywhere, anywhere as near as much as it used to. What are you gonna do? I understand okay. getting shot at, but I don't like it. <laughs> oh yeah, really. Next shooter. It's not actually a sentry. Or a, um, a stun lancer, it's a sentry. Menace one five, hostile interceptors are on high okay, speed spark. approach. Your window for extraction is closing. <laughs> okay. Three out of six out alive. Ish. Commander, we failed in our mission. Holy shit! We'll need to review our tactics and improve going forward.
you know, I think it all went bad when I had that one Grenadier. Vicious Koala move up to a position that was detected by Advent. That one tile. For some reason, these guys got an amazing view range. Look at that. 19 days, 22 days, and I lost three sergeants. One of which, this specialist, was very, very well trained in the Advanced Warfare Center. Deadpool was very well trained in stealth tactics, and VK was, I believe, built as an overall, um, yeah, an overall grenadier. The one good thing is that the Spark is now promoted, but he's gravely <laughs> wounded for 29 days. Yeah. Um, Shredder. So that's a fucking failure right there. Let me know what your thoughts are down below, because I really don't know. I think that one Grenadier, just tripping that group of four, that's when it all started to go terribly, terribly wrong. Let me know what you think. I look forward to seeing your insights on this. If I got your character killed today, I'm sorry. It happens. I just didn't hope or didn't expect to get three surgeons killed this fast. Because this is starting to really, really hurt the roster. Like, initially, um, I can deal with rookies or squaddies, but up from there, corporals, sergeants, this is when it starts to get painful. This is what you really start to notice. So hopefully I can go to the black market and get some new guys, because we desperately need reinforcements. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed that shit show, and I'll see you tomorrow for more XCOM.